Hello everyone, welcome to the Codeverse. In this video, we will learn about the difference between program, process and thread. We will also learn the real life application of the threads in our YouTube application. First, let's understand what is program. Program is nothing but line of code that we write to achieve some task. Consider, you want to write a Java code that will add two numbers. So, line of code you will write to achieve this task is called as program. The program is saved in hard disk. When you execute a program, then this program will be moved to the RAM and it will start executing. So, program in execution is called as process. Process. Program is just a line of code that we write and it is stored in a hard disk. When executing this program, Java will ask for two numbers as an input and then display their addition. This program in execution is called as process. Now let's understand what is thread and why we need it. Threads are used when you want to perform multiple tasks at the same time. Let's understand this with the help of real life examples. Consider a YouTube video. So when you play YouTube video, there are lots of tasks going on at the same time like playing video, showing related video, showing comments, showing ads and you can see that all of these tasks are running at the same time. Here threads comes into the picture. Threads help us to execute the multiple tasks at the same time that is parallelly. You can write the code of a task and then execute it in a threads. So consider YouTube as a program in execution that is process and all these tasks as a thread. For example, you can create one thread for playing video, another thread for showing recommended video, another thread for showing comments etc. Now let's understand some properties of a thread. One process can have multiple threads. Threads shares the code and data of the process but threads have their own local variables and local memory. Process doesn't directly share data with another process. This makes thread more efficient than a process and this is the reason why thread is called as lightweight process. Every time program executes it is converted into process and by default the process will create one main thread which will execute all of our code. So even if you are not manually creating thread, JVM or any other programming language will automatically create one main thread for you. That's it for today's video. If you like this video then please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.